Hey y'all, this is Seize the Day with Colette. Today I am inviting you to start your day off with a moment of encouragement with me, Colette, so that we can seize our day together, taking a hold of it and steering it towards what we really want. And I want to thank you for taking time out of your day to spend it with me And I'm expecting by the end of our time together today, you will be more encouraged, inspired, and ready to seize your day. So let's get into today's podcast. The Lord has done great things for us. We are glad. Psalms 126 verse 3. It's such a short verse. Happy Wednesday. It's hump day. Maybe that's why it's a good thing. It's a short verse because it's the middle of the week and you're making it. You have what it takes (laughs) to seize the day. And so do I. And um, (laughs) the truth that like it, this verse makes me think of the joy of the Lord as my strength. But the Lord has done great things for us. We are glad. You know, I, I just really had a thought come through my mind about to take a hold of this day to seize it from start to finish. It has such a great impact on me, but it has an impact on my kids on my husband, on the people that I spend time with throughout the day. And that's the gift of what it is like to seize a day, to take a hold of a day. There's this beauty of really experiencing, hmm, wow, really experiencing such a truth of understanding all that is so good and all that God has done and just again as I stated yesterday giving glory and praise back to God but celebrating that all along God is so good and his plan comes to pass again if I don't get weary and be and grow faint and that gives me hope hope to seize my day let us pray our father in heaven holy is your name your kingdom come your will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us today our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we also have forgiven our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. And may we remember, God, that when we forgive people, when they sin against us, you, our Heavenly Father, also forgive us. But if we do not forgive others their sins, you, our Heavenly Father, will not forgive us our sins. In Jesus' name, amen. And as we bring our time together to a close, how can taking time to be quiet, pause and reflect, make today better? What more is there to look forward to in this day? Will I choose how today will go? Will I allow today's events to happen to me or through the decisions and choices I make I can choose the effect that my decisions and choices have on how today will happen through me this was seize the day with Colette today contains within it new mercies that are full of infinite possibilities So that means I can choose and you can choose to make today a great day 
And until we meet again, I bid you adieu. And have a great day, y'all. Bye-bye for now.